<laughs> thank you, Mayor, Mayor. Good morning, everybody. I want to start by thanking, actually, the LAUSD uh, School Board, uh, Superintendent Carvalho, and of course, Mayor Bass for really including Metro in this uh, event this morning. I actually had my initial meeting with the superintendent, I think about four months after you started, superintendent. And he was passionate and he was clear about the priorities for academic excellence and equity and how he saw how Metro can be a partner in helping deliver those things. So thank you for today. You are a man of your word. I am really grateful to be here because with the superintendent's support, as well as with our mayor's support and our entire Metro board, the community has responded very positively to our Go Pass pilot program. You know, our success would not have been possible without LAUSD raising their hand and said, yes, we're in. We see the value. This is the first pilot phase of our Fairless System Initiative, which is the framework through which we are pursuing the ultimate goal, as the mayor said, of ensuring that cost is not a barrier to use our system. For me, this Go Pass program meets what I call our mobility bottom line. It's a triple bottom line. It's good for people, it's good for the planet, and it's good for the progress on equity in our region. For people, you heard it from President Dillon and Vice President Dulce, Go Passes not only give students the freedom to go to school or extracurricular activities or wherever else they want to go, they give their families options too. So I know we've named it the Go Pass, but it's really the Freedom Pass when you listen to these testimonies. More than 350,000 students now have a free, safe, and reliable way to fulfill the everyday obligations of life, including more than half LAUSD students. So that's flexibility, and that's the freedom to take the system anywhere they need and want to go. And for our planet, Transit is the best tool we have in our mobility tool belt to move large amounts of people quickly while reducing climate warming pollution. And giving students like those at LAUSD familiarity with the transit system early on, we hope will help make them lifelong transit riders which pays environmental dividends far into the future. And finally, for the progress of equity in the region, the Go Passes support our families that need help with the transportation the most. Transportation is the number two household expense for families, so giving students free transit passes can help alleviate transportation strain on household budgets, something that is top of mind for so many people in our community. So we're proud that so many students are choosing to use their Go Pass to go metro, and parents are believing in Metro as well by entrusting us with their trip. And almost 300 of Fauchet students have signed up for Go Passes just this school year. And they've already taken more than 10,000 trips on our system in just the last couple of months. So again, in the name of academic excellence, let's closing uh, the digital divide and the impacts of the pandemic with learning loss. We're getting people to attend school we're doing well for our planet, and we're helping improve Metro. So thank you very much. I think you light about all of the media groups. What are you going to do to increase some type of safety precautions, um, patrolling because certain lines are extremely dangerous for families and children? So we're committed to ensuring a safe trip, particularly for the students who are riding our system. Not only do we have a program that we share with all of the schools to inform the parents and the students about safe writing and travel tips, we've increased our visible presence of whether it is our ambassador program, our law enforcement, and our transit security officers to in particular be focused on the lines that serve our schools. 